This was a flood like no other. We've been um, here for 46 years living in this area and that's as high as the water came to. The 2017 came in about here mm -hmm. and this one, you can see where it got to. I was around when Cyclone Tracy happened in the Northern Territory, but this, that was huge. But this is on a much bigger scale. As we were out as part of the Mud Army, and a lot of Rotarians were, also uh, feeding the Mud Army and feeding people, you know, they're homeless, they've got no food. And so, you know, we did our sort of Bunnings barbecue without Bunnings yeah. uh, and got that into action pretty quickly yeah. in a number of places. And I think what we've found is what we, we can do best is money um, and we can use the funds through our district um, flood appeal um, to put that into clubs to get, out, get that out to the people on the ground that need it. I would say five, six years down the track we'll still be doing recovery work with the community. And it will go on for years. We haven't touched yet the psychological problems that we have to and when it rains heavily again, kids get scared and adults get scared. We will be continuing on in one way or another and when money's donated we can give it out and acquit it mm. and, and, and honoured and humbled to be able to, in this position, I have to say. Mm.